Little Meadow Mouse by Annie Mae Va Van Dowie and Alexandra Kirvin. Little Meadow Mouse by Annie Mae Va Van Dowie and Alexandra Kirvin. I found something. Hamster was digging in the dirt. He had found a little basket. He'll definitely fit in here, Beaver nodded. Hamster and Beaver had been searching for a little bed for little Meadow Mouse. The mouse had been born that morning. They took the basket to Mommy Meadow Mouse and put the little one in it. Never before had they seen such a tiny baby. Beaver and Hamster were so happy that little Meadow Mouse had been born. Porcupine too, he danced for joy. But Squirrel looked sad. Something is wrong, he whispered. And he sat down with a sigh. Squirrel was right. Little Meadow Mouse wouldn't eat and wouldn't drink. He was very ill. Maybe he is dying, Porcupine said, and he looked around in fright. Hamster shook his head, turned around and went to get more food. Beaver got brushwood and made a fire. Without saying a word, Squirrel wrote Little Meadow Mouse's name in the dirt. That evening, Mommy Meadow Mouse held her little one in her lap. Hamster, beaver, and porcupine stroked his hand for a little while. Little Meadow Mouse took a deep breath in and then let it out really slowly. It was his final breath. Everything turned dark. Beaver stamped his feet, hamster cried, and squirrel sighed. Porcupine walked around in circles. Come, we'll take him to the other side, Mommy Meadow Mouse said after a while. Mommy Meadow Mouse gave her little one a kiss and placed the basket in the sea so that the waves could take it along with them. Is it nice on the other side? Porcupine asked. I think so. Will we ever see him there? I hope so. Will he ever come by to say hello? No. Everyone was quiet. We will miss him, Squirrel sighed, and we will not forget him. Then he wrote Little Meadow Mouse's name in the sand. Beaver gathered more wood to make fire. Hamster fetched something nice to eat. Porcupine told stories about Little Meadow Mouse and how sweet he was. We should do this every once in a while, Mommy Meadow Mouse said. Everyone nodded, one at a time. And the basket? It floated quietly out of sight. <laughs>